Sometimes we don't read salah, we couldn't be bothered. We don't want to dress appropriately, we couldn't be bothered. Then we want all our problems in our lives to be sorted out? No, they will. we have sown a seed of problems. How then can we have solutions when we have not yet sown the seeds of solutions? So when you now start reading your salah, you're an honest person, you've given up your bad habits, you've cut out your time that you've wasted on the net, pornography is cut out, everything else is cut out, all these illicit chats are cut out, and you know, the dress is okay, everything is okay. All you've done is you've planted the seeds of solutions to your problems. You water it and keep watering it, your tree will keep growing. Don't think it's an overnight thing. Someone says, you know, I never read salah, but I read fajr, my problems are still not solved. Come on, come on. You're only planting the seed. You need to now water the plant, continue further and further. Then only you will find that the, the whole tree will grow. And if one or two branches fall out, you're still a happy person. And you're thanking Allah. Ya Allah, you've given me such a beautiful life. I've got so much to thank you for. A lot of us concentrate only on the negatives. Yet we have billions of positives. If you are to count the gifts of Allah upon you, you will never be able to, to count them. Never.